I grew up in Back Row, Bradley Brook. Mm -hmm. And what was it like when you were growing up? Uh, it was a great place. It was a great place. Uh, in front of the house was a mountain of white gypsum, as beautiful as you'd ever see. And it had some spruce trees on it and some hardwood trees on it. And in the fall, the hardwood trees would turn lovely red and orange. At the back of our house was a, a, a limestone rock a big limestone rock and the in a river valley so we used to call it the valley of the brook and up the valley of the brook was a limestone quarry and the stones that built St. Ninian's Cathedral were extracted from that quarry in the 1800s and we had a lovely barn it was a barn probably about 40 by 80 and it was built in the side of a bank and the first story was supported by limestone rock uh, limestone the second story was built by haymow it was built by uh, hemlock uh, beams the beams were probably about 14 by 14 and it was secured by uh, wooden pegs there were two brooks on the property. There was one brook that led off the uh, mountain and it drained into the Briley Brook. There was fish in both of those brooks. I fished uh, I fished uh, out of one brook with my hands. I started when I was five and I fished out of the other brook with a with a fishing rod and I did that till I finally left. There was lots of deer there and uh, we used to help follow take the deer off deer and moose off the mountain that they that they shot and there was a two old old and very lovely apple orchards there and people would come in the fall to get apples and they loved the apples there was winter apples that only got ripe about january and uh all sorts of things like that I had, a, I had 11 brothers and sisters, 12 in the family for all, and I was in the sixth spot. And uh, my mother was an Irish woman from Newfoundland by the name of Downey, and my father was a Scot. And uh, he went on the property when he was 18, and he died there till he was eight, when he was 80. And uh, oh, it was a great upbringing. It was a, I'm not doing justice to it, but I'm doing my best. It was a lovely, lovely upbringing.